Recently, the actor Mel Gibson was asked what he thinks about evolution. Let's check out his response. What are your thoughts on evolution? Hmm. Wow. Eh. <laughs> the Darwin thing? Mm. Yeah. I don't really go for it. No? Yeah. Ice Age, dinosaurs, you know. What did they turn into? I mean, things became extinct at some point. I don't think I was some kind of like, you know, legless thing that crawled out of the ocean. I don't think I came from that. Okay. Okay. Well, Mel Gibson, good news. Our early fishy ancestors that did crawl out of the ocean, they were not fully legless. We evolved from lobe finned fish. Our arms and legs are adapted lobe fins. Tiktaalik is one of the most famous fish-like fossils that was coming out on land early on. Probably not our direct ancestor because we have footprints from earlier. You probably know that today there are several groups of fish that are doing this again. Mud skippers are the most famous case, but others do exist, including a group of sharks. Our ancestors, before they came out onto land, were probably benthic fish, fish that hang out on the floor of lakes, rivers, or oceans. There are many species who do this today. Many of them have evolved this ability independently. There's a lot of benefits of just hanging out on the ocean floor. This one right here is one of the, the benthic species that was discovered well, it was discovered in the 1800s, but it was filmed live for the first time fairly recently and then in the past like five years, I want to say. And it is one of my favorites. It's adorable. Look at this guy <laughs> using his fins like feet and legs. The name of this species is Chow Knockups coloratus. I just call it the Darwin fish because it looks like those Darwin fish bumper stickers people used to have back in the 90s.